Hi, welcome back to I'm Just Dinosaurs, and today we're gonna draw the Gigantosaurus head from Dominion, Jurassic World Dominion. So what I'm doing now is I'm drawing a circle uh, to indicate where the eye and the ears would be. So that's where we're gonna start drawing the head from. So now uh, we are doing, starting to draw the outline of the Gigantosaurus head, which looks like uh, a uh, long snout longer than a T-Rex much thinner Afterwards, uh, we are going to draw the lower jaw as well as the neck Alright So we are going to make this uh, going to draw this as 3D as possible Trying to add this front of its face a bit so it's not just looking to the left Now we are starting to make it 3D We can kind of get a curve right there To show uh, the front And draw that uh, brown line uh, And get the left, left side of its face just like a carnival. I'm gonna draw it on the other side as well. At this point, uh, we're gonna start adding a bit more details. That line would be indicating the uh, middle part of its face. And now we're gonna draw the nose. Afterwards, we're gonna draw a row of teeth. So the Gigantosaurus is thief from Jurassic World, for Jurassic World Dominion uh, shows it to have curvature, curvature teeth and it's sharp and quite long with different sides So we're gonna uh, fast forward this to drawing off the teeth Feel free to uh, pause the video anytime if you can't catch up. Now we're gonna uh, press a bit harder on our pencil to start drawing the the lines, which will show. The solid lines basically on how on the permanent lines to show some of the details on the dinosaur's face, which is the dragon Now we're going to draw some of this. I don't know what it's called, but I think it's cavities. I don't even know what's the term. Let's start drawing these lines on the face. So now we're gonna draw uh, some sharp spikes along his spine. They're pretty big and wide. So draw them uh, lightly first. Password uh, it's not gonna be the official bolt line yet. After we have drawn the uh, spine, we're gonna start to the brows. Uh, so the brows are pretty rough and sharp. And they're just they're pretty bumpy. 
that's for sure so we draw them quite bumpy yeah so now we're gonna draw in the eyes so the eyes will be drawn uh, with a more curved line at the bottom with a much straighter curve the pupil uh, we will draw a circle right beside the pupil to show a highlight some wrinkles at the bottom of the eye So now we're gonna do these touch ups on the face. Draw a bumpy lines right in the middle there. We're about to get into the shading part for the mouth. We can start with the bottom mouth. So shading of the mouth be quite dark so it's basically just uh, darkness in there so we're gonna try to skip this part I'm gonna show you how after of how it looks like so this is how it would look like uh, the teeth aren't that all black so all black shaded so um, it's just partially dark that's all some nice shading lines uh, to make it have some texture and now we're gonna move on to uh, the adding of the skills on the face basically this, this is the shading face So I'm just gonna speed up the process and uh, do a time lapse for the whole head. Now we're gonna start with the spine. Finishing up, then finishing up the neck, which is be the last step in finishing this joint. But uh, I'm drawing the armor on it along its neck, the spine. So I'm just gonna try and uh, get the accurate armor on the back from Jesse Wilson.
this point I'm just drawing the vein and then starting with the shading as the normal like the head uh, the shading is going to be different on the post notifications and i'll see you in the next one